Hey, hey, happy Monday. Okay, so this is my um, notebook, one of like a million because I'm super type A. That means that I like to make lists and checklists and like anything that you can make a list of, I've probably done it. I make lists of my lists. So this is one of my notebooks and today I'm gonna to share with you um, one of my lists in my notebook that I use to um, keep track of my progress. So this is kind of like a progress checklist, if you will. Um, so I'm gonna share that with you today, but first, hey to all our replay viewers who are catching these first few seconds, and hey to everybody who's jumping on. How's your Monday going? You guys having a good day? Today's been crazy for us. Um, with the time change, the boys have been up super early and we've still got like snotty noses and cough kind of stuff. Uh, standard Monday, yeah. So we've got all that. And then I had mops today. Jackson has preschool on Mondays. Warren, the poor Warrenator, listen to this. Um, thank you. So Warren fell asleep. Oh gosh, here we go. Uh, let's block some people. Warren fell asleep um, on the drive to drop Jackson off to preschool because he got up so early, so he was tired. He fell asleep. Yay, you're printing apps by Christmas. Awesome. He fell asleep, the Warrenator. <laughs> yeah, so Warren, um, he fell asleep on my on the way to drop Jackson off to preschool. So I had to wake him up and, and bring Jackson in, um, put him back in his car seat, drove to Mops. Guess what? Fell asleep at Mops. I actually sat in the parking lot for a little while because, yeah, babies don't believe in the time change. Um, because I just felt so bad for him. He was so tired. So I let him sleep for a little bit. Then I had to carry him in. Of course, he woke up. So he went and played at Mops. I had some great time with other moms and then we had to go pick Jackson back up from preschool. And can you believe he fell asleep on the way to preschool again? So he's he fell asleep like four times that he had to be woken up from. Um, I'm just gonna keep blocking. So we'll just do like the blocking game at, as needed. Um, mops is moms of preschoolers. It's, it's really cool, it's a cool group. They have them like all across the country. So you can look into that. Yeah, the struggle is real. So um, Warren's finally napping. Jackson had lunch and um, I bribed Jackson with a TV show. Am I allowed to say that I did that? Yeah, and so he's watching a show while I um, talk with you guys for a second. So I'm gonna show you and share with you and I'm gonna read them because I have a lot of questions in this notebook. Um, my progress checklist questions. Okay, I what is up with this? Is there like more people than ever on Periscope that need blocked? I'm just gonna keep blocking. So if we need to, can anybody else block for me or do I have to block for myself? Does anybody know? Um, yeah, Lindsay. Yeah, you had to block a bunch of people on your scope, didn't you? The chi like Chinese, what's going on? Like people are crazy. Um, okay, so first, how about this? Um, while while we all block people, um, will you tell me? <laughs> Lost my train of thought because I'm like freaking out about how to block people. Um, it's really creepy seeing all the creepers. Yeah, um, will you tell me if you're a Beyond Fit Life sister so I know who's on, and if you're not a Beyond Fit Life sister, if you're new, you can tell me you're new so we can welcome you. Um, so let's do that really quick, and let's um, let's freak out all the creepers. We'll freak them out. Um, yeah, I have an echo. I have no idea why, I'm sorry. Um, sister Stephanie, hey. Yeah, don't mind the haters. Hey, you're new, awesome. Sister Liz, sister from Newburn, hey Amy. Hey, I'm already playing out boot camp workout. Get ready. Plank, plank, plank. Hey, Victoria. Awesome. Second time. Awesome. Hey, Amanda. Hey, Alyssa. Okay, so um, how about this? Um, I want to know who is on, new or sister. I want to know if you guys are list makers. So on a scale of 1 to 10, how listy are you? I don't think listy is a word, but we're going to make it a word. So 1 is like you've never made a list in your life. And 10 is like you're addicted to lists. Okay. Oh yeah, we got we got 15. That's right. Okay, so I'm a listy lister. I'm like a type AAA personality and so I love lists. Yeah, you love lists. Okay. So, you need to get out a piece of paper and a pen because you're going to want this list. In fact, 
if you're on my email list, if you're a Beyonce Life Sister and you're on the email list, <laughs> I'm your super listy. You, I sent this list via email this morning. So you could just print the email and then you already have the list made. But I know some of you guys are new or maybe you're not part of a Beyonce community. So you might not have gotten the email. So I'm going to read them out to you and you can write them down. Okay. So is everybody ready? Here we go. So these are questions that I use. I ask myself um, to kind of measure my progress. Progress. I'm so spastic. Mm. Well, I don't know. It's just how. It's just who I am. Just am who I am. Okay. Does Beyond Baby get the email? You should be on our list. Yeah. So check your email. And if you didn't get it, let me know. It might be in your junk. It might be in your junk email. Um, okay. Yeah. Own it. I'm owning it. Okay. Um, okay, so this is the list that I use to keep myself kind of on track. I just ask myself from time to time um, how I'm doing. And um, I like to remind myself and yeah, love who you are, right? And um, my clients, all of our Beyond Fit Life sisters, I like to remind you that what's, um, what is measured can be managed. And so um, with being a list maker, we're just gonna go ahead and block because um, this is this is not for weirdos. With being a list maker, there, there are some benefits because if you measure things, if you take an inventory, if you track your progress, then you can manage and you can adjust and you can see um, how you're doing, okay? So we're gonna block anybody who doesn't wanna be here and here is the list, okay? So first, um, are you keeping a food and exercise journal? Okay, so that's list, that's question number one. Did you eat breakfast? Do you eat breakfast? Do you strive for five? And that's what I'm calling two fruit servings and three vegetable servings a day. Now, I really would love for you to have more, but that's kind of like the minimum. So strive for five is a really easy, it's easy, it's super easy way for you to make sure you're getting enough fruits and veggies. Two fruit servings um, per day and at least three veggie servings. The more the better with the fibrous veggies, okay? Here's another one. Do or did you, if you're tracking for yourself, um, do you eat your three meals and two snacks a day, even if you're not hungry? And um, yay, good. Thank you're welcome for the list. Um, yeah, you can download this, Beyond Fit Life members. You can download this in the members portal as well. I want to make it as easy as possible for you. Okay. So, um, did you eat your three meals and two snacks a day, even if you're not hungry? Did you drink half your body weight in ounces of water today or daily? Um, did you get 25 to 30 grams of fiber per day? And you are going to have to track that, um, for maybe just a couple of days to make sure that you're on track. And then after a while, you kind of know that you're getting enough or that you didn't get enough. Um, how about this one? Do you mix carbohydrates and protein in most meals and snacks? So I never want to have a meal or a snack that's just carbs. I always want to make sure at the very least that I'm having protein at every meal and at every snack. Okay, so that's another one. Um, let's see, did you get enough sleep? Which I usually am answering no. <laughs> Just being honest, this is one that I'm struggling with. Um, do, did you have a set kitchen curfew time? Kitchen curfew is basically a rule that I set for myself to get out of the kitchen. I am such, um, I'm such like a stress kind of emotional mindless eater um, and I've come a long, long, long ways but this is one thing that's really helped me is I just set a time and it's like, no, the kitchen's closed. Like dinner's done, um, I'm cleaned up, I don't need to be in the kitchen, you know, at nine o'clock at night rummaging through the pantry. Um, I, I should go to bed and then I get a star for my sleep question, right? Instead of just snacking. If I want something and I just posted this in the Beyond Fit Life Facebook Facebook group. I said my goal for this week was to stay away from the Halloween candy. And I said that one way I'm going to do that is to, um, um, yay, you're excited, kitchen curfew, is to drink fat loss friendly hot cocoa. So I'll drink a fat loss friendly hot cocoa and that'll keep my mouth busy and I'll get myself out of the kitchen. Kitchen curfew. Okay, so everybody, we can all do that together. All our Beyond Fit Life sisters, let's um, abide by kitchen curfew this week. Okay, let's see, where did I leave off? Did, did I exercise? Um, do I have some? 
someone as a support person. And if you're a Beyond Fit Life sister, you have built in support. I'm serious. Like ask any single person in our Beyond Fit Life Club and they will take you under their wing. You will have an accountability partner probably within a minute of posting that you need support on Facebook. I'm really, really sick. So- I'm so serious. We love you and we will support you in any way you can. So make sure you have a support person. Um, And then this, this is a good one. Do you put yourself in tempting situations to overeat or make bad eating choices? So for example, um, don't leave a bowl of candy out on, you know, your entryway table if that's going to be tempting to you. Don't put yourself in a situation situation where you're going to have to use like crazy willpower. Yeah, you got your group. Awesome. Um, yes, Beyond Fit is the best. Best emojis ever. Ant, weightlifting emoji, fist pump. You got it. You got it, sister. Um, so, so those are the questions. Um, again, you can download these questions in the members portal. You, if you are on the email list, you got them via email. Um, and if you're not, you can watch this replay and take notes. Um, but a better idea, how about this? If you're not part of Beyond Fit Life yet, you really want to join. You can find out all the information at beyondfitlife.com. But tomorrow, we are having our Beyond Fit Life coaching call. So if you kind of want to see what it's like, but you're not ready to commit and to join, how about this? Join us for our coaching call for free. All our Beyond Fit Life sisters who are in the in the um, Periscope, they'll tell you, like, we talk for about an hour um, about everything that you can possibly think of to help you live a healthy, happy, and balanced life. Tomorrow night, 7 p.m., um, I'm going to be talking about some healthy holiday stuff, and I'm going to be telling you about the Abs by Christmas challenge. So our Beyond Fit Life sisters, you already have access to Abs by Christmas, but we're officially starting on November 13th. So I'm going to run through the challenge, give you some tips, give you some details. I'll even share kind of more about my progress checklist for myself and these questions um, tomorrow. But yeah, they're so much fun because it's just, it's like our time to hang Hang out and to chat together. So I hope that you'll join us. If you aren't a member and you want to just see what it's like, um, you can go to beyondfitlife.com slash monthly webinar and you can sign up there and I'll send you everything you need to log in. We have like a little chat room and um, you, you'll you see my presentation up on the screen. Actually, I do like seriously, I, I really want this to be a good coaching time for you. So we put a lot of work into getting um, the presentation right and and um, to making it so that it's very valuable. So I love Periscope. Um, I guess some people think I'm spastic. I don't know. Um, But this coaching call is even better than Periscope because I'm sitting down, my kids, my kids are with Patrick and Yeah, the webinar is what hooked you. Awesome, that's awesome. And I'm really focusing on teaching you. That's one of my passions, you know. I have a degree in exercise physiology. I've been in the fitness industry for over 10 years. And I can't just tell you um, there's a missing piece of the puzzle. And so I think education and teaching women how to do fitness better, that's our hashtag, right? How to how to train, how to eat, and how to balance their hormones. Thank you. Thanks for making me feel better. I've had a lot of coffee today, but this is really just me, so... If I'm spastic, I'm spastic. And I'm a list maker, so I don't know. Uh, So anyways, it's a passion of mine. And I love each month, the first Tuesday of every month, 7 p.m. I love talking with you guys. So if you're not a member, you're welcome to listen in. You won't have access to everything that our members have access to, but you will be able to listen and get some great information on the call. Um, I actually, I take notes in this. This notebook is crazy. I take notes in this notebook. Let me tell you some of the stuff. Do you want a sneak peek? Who wants a sneak peek? Hearts, if you want a sneak peek of what we're going to talk about tomorrow. Let's see. Um, I have written down to talk about a (laughs) thank you. You make me feel better, Shannon. Thank you. Um, Okay. A step-by-step plan to flatten your stomach and lose inches. I'm serious. Inches around your waist. You want that? tomorrow. Uh, Real life tips to prepare mentally and physically. So these are my own personal, I brainstormed. It takes me a lot of time to prepare these coaching calls because there's so much I want to share with you. So I sat down, I brainstormed some of my best tips to prepare, not just physically, but also mentally for a busy, um, but healthy holiday season. So I'll share that tomorrow night. Um, And I'm also going to help you to get a jump on your new year's resolution because I think it stinks when the fitness industry tries to sell you a bunch of new year's 
crap when what they could really do is help you not gain the average five to 10 pounds that Americans gain during the time from Thanksgiving to Christmas. Like what if you just didn't gain that? then how much easier would it be to get to your New Year's resolution, right? Um, so we'll talk about that so you can get your best body ever, um, even through the holidays. And then you'll also get to download the Holiday Survival Guide, which is in the Members Portal already. And that's a free gift that I'm giving away to everybody who registers. So you can register at beyondfitlife.com slash monthly webinar. Okay. And we're going to talk tomorrow. Patrick will have the voice. It will be quiet. I'll be sitting down. We'll be chatting. You can make some fat loss friendly hot cocoa because kitchen curfew, right? Um, and we don't end the kitchen and we can all chat together and I can answer some more questions for you then. Okay. Um, so how does that sound? Anybody have any questions? I am so, so, so excited to chat with everybody tomorrow. If there's anything that you need in the meantime, Log into the members group on Facebook um, and, and I'll be in there. I'm, I think I'll have a few minutes today to pop in um, before things get crazy again. I have chicken in the crock pot for dinner, so at least that's part like part we part of the way done. Um, hey, thanks. Yeah, so okay, so go to beyondforlife.com slash monthly webinar if you're not already registered, and we'll send you all of the information to log in tomorrow night, 7 p.m. Um, after our Christmas, baby. We're doing it and we're doing it. Oh, and Planksgiving. Um, don't forget to post your planks. Um, Facebook and Instagram. I'm posting mine. I beat the rain this morning, which was awesome. Um, and you can find all of that on um Instagram, Beyond Fit Mom, or Beyond Fit Moms with an S. Yay! I hope that, I felt like I really wanted to give away really awesome bonus material this month. So I hope, that's like my little, I guess, holiday gift. We'll call it that. Um, so I hope that that was helpful. Thanks for the encouragement, Amy. I, I really do want you guys to, to have everything that you need. So I hope that helps. Okay, well, um, get your list done and yeah you printed everything perfect and I'll plan to talk to you guys all tomorrow 7 p.m. Um, I'm Eastern Standard Time and you can register again if you haven't yet beyondfitlife.com slash monthly webinar have a great Monday love you bye